five times the UFC has tried to put this fight together, and it finally goes down tonight. Khabib Nurmagomedov versus Tony Ferguson, two of the most accomplished lightweights in UFC history. Many people believe. Oh, massive slam! That'll change the complexion of this one. Close guard. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but... Right now, it looks like he may be trying to set up an arm triangle choke. He needs to secure the left arm, push it across, and secure it with his head. Watch triangle, watch triangle. He needs to push the arm to the side, get his head against the mat. Now watch, as he goes to the finish, watch his chest go to the mat. Oh, he might have got him with a choke. Side control now, DC. When you get side control in a fight, what are you looking at? When I get to the side control of the fight, and I believe now he's attacking the triangle. Triangle looks pretty tight, DC. I'm no Brazilian jiu-jitsu black belt, but maybe not good here. No, it looks like it's getting in deep. Watch triangle, watch triangle. There he is. He's moving to the finishing position. Now watch he go parallel right next to his opponent. When it's time to finish, he has to go flat, chest to the back. And he's out. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this. He's going to start trying to move to a submission here. It looks like he's trying to attack with the arm triangle. Watch triangle, watch triangle. Now he's okay. Now he's going to escape. Uh, working out of side control here. His opponent trying to control posture, but you got to be careful here. Oh, wow, that happened quickly as the fighter reverses position there on the ground. Unbelievable. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. The Kimura is not the arm. It's the shoulder pressure that usually makes you tap. Nice little guy. And he is back up to his feet. Oh, massive kick. Didn't see that one coming. Really making good use of his reach advantage there with that punch. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Oh, he gets the takedown late in the round. Very useful here towards the tail end of the frame. Close guard. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent, you gotta be careful. Right now, it looks like he may. He's trying to set up an arm triangle choke. He needs to secure the left arm, push it across, and secure it with his head. Oh, we're getting a finish here. Oh, and there's the horn at the end of the round. How about this fight, folks? You see, he was nearly caught in a submission there right at the end of the round, saved by the bell. So back to the stool, mentally probably not in a great place here. We'll see it. Round two is here. Khabib Nurmagomedov versus Tony Ferguson. Oh! He's giving him so many different things right now. Immediately gets the underhook. El Kukui gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to show oh, he up the defense here, though. He can't take too many of those uppercuts. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Double leg shot. Oh, perfect entry to slam him down. Remaining active here in his pursuit of the submission. Another attempt here. Oh, nice. No, actually, oh. he goes to an inverted triangle to try to get the finish. Out. to the feet now. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. And both guys really throwing with authority. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting the combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand, jab, 
right hand hook. That's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man. Let this guy have the whole thing. So we pull up the numbers for you here. How about this, DC? 34 total strikes. And look at the post on the opposite side to give himself the correct space to land these beautiful knees. Changes levels now, DC. Oh, man, he was in a single. Got to a high crotch. Oh. He flips him over the top, but a huge takedown. I mean, do I survive that, or did I read my last round? Absolutely not. You don't survive it. It's over. It's over, John. Watch triangle. Watch triangle. to the side, get his head against the mat. Now watch as he goes to the finish. Watch his chest go to the mat. And this might just be a matter of time. <laughs> wow. Side control now, and certainly I would think more offensive options for the bottom fighter than in the half guard. Absolutely more offensive options because now you can just start to. Oh, you gotta watch him attack his submissions. He throws the legs up to try to get a triangle choke here. Watch triangle, watch triangle. All right, let's look back at some of the action in that round, DC. What a high level display of offensive wrestling. I mean, this is a joy. Third round underway. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. Really starting to connect on a lot of strikes to the midsection here in the latter stages of this fight. Continues to work out of that tight clinch. And now some knees. Now he's got the Muay Thai plot. Shot a double leg. Oh, nice slam as he gets into the canvas. Exactly what he needed. All right, operating inside the closed guard now. Man, isn't it fun to watch this dude? He got his foot on the hip, and now he's throwing up a triangle attempt. He's gonna try to move his left arm across to get pressure on the choke. My triangle, my triangle. There he is, he's moving to the finishing position. Now watch, he goes parallel right next to his opponent. When is he gone? He's gone, he's gone. Absolutely, he finishes his opponent by way of submission. it done by submission tonight, champ. Just watch how slowly he approaches the submission, though. He never rushes. He takes his time, but it's his trickiness. It's his ability to trick people into going to the floor with him that puts them in danger and finishing fights. So there he is, your winner by submission. That could hold up as one of the better subs of the year near perfect execution tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve LeBing has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 45 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by tap out, Khabib!